Ladies and gentlemen, my father was a late lot of water, 1947 to 1954. The chairman, Awori Tourism, and also chairman, Awori Day Cultural Festival. I'm also the former deputy president of Nigerian Association of Tour Operators. Uh, presently, the chairman of Association of Tourism Practitioner of Nigeria Southwest. <laughs> Uh, well, if I have to tell you exactly who Prince Ferdinand is, it will take a lot of time. But I'll just uh, describe him briefly as a Prince of Ota. He's a tourism practitioner and uh, he's been successful in so many ways, you know, within the tourism world. When you look back to the Awori Day that was organized, he successfully handled the Awori Day Festival. If you look at the quality of the festival, you will agree with me that uh, it's a first-class tourism practitioner. And uh, he's been in the industry for quite a while. And uh, if you look at uh, what he has been doing to Ota, basically, if you look at the second-story building in Nigeria, he successfully transformed the area where the missionary stayed and it was even at that point that the uh, English Bible was translated to Yoruba by Ajayi Crowder. So these are the things he has done for Ota. I think he's a fantastic tour operator. He's been involved in moving people, tourists from Israel to Nigeria, Nigeria to Israel, and also the Gambia to a larger extent. He's a gentleman. I believe he's going to do more to our land, especially in the area of uh, showcasing Awori culture, and that is what I expect from him from now on. Awori cultural festival, I'm at Oh, Mama, don't love you. Awori cultural festival, I'm at Shea. I Baba Loki. You play his old you. Hey, don't bolo no card, you I am Alaji Taufik Dari Akinde, the Are Adini of Ota, Awoli land. I'm a bona fide son of the soil, that's Awoli land. I was born and bred in Ota, Awoli land here. My father, my mother, they are both Ota people. If I have to continue talking about Awoli day, I will spend the whole day, but let me just be brief. I was delighted because it was a cause for my race, a service to my people. And uh, even though I was so busy, from my busy schedules, I ensured that I made time available. As an accountant, a professional accountant, their financial positions, I monitor everything. And uh, by the end of the whole project, we, we were able to render a very good account. And uh, we were hoping to achieve a better thing in the coming one. If I am called upon again to serve my people, I will just be ready to. Was made the initiator of the Awori Cultural Festival. Well, my name is um, Omoba Adetunji Femi Fadino. My father was a late lot of water, 1947 to 1954. This has been a paramount thing in my heart as a tourism consultant. I'm presently the chairman of the Southwest Association of Tourism Practitioners of Nigeria wow. and formerly deputy president of Nigerian Association of Tour Operators. After opening up the Gambia, I felt strongly that we could do better in my own community. In 2008, we did what is called destination evaluation, meaning that we came into the community to actually evaluate all the products. In the course of evaluating all these products, we found out that we had quite a lot that we can explain. So we come up with a tourism development master plan and that was about 234 pages. And that we found out that we need an intro. So in the course of this intro, we felt that we needed to work with a bigger audience to actually get what we really wanted. And as God will have it, you know, KBSC a lot of what I met Babajide Sonwolu on the course of meeting Babajide Sonwolu. A lot of things happened after that and I already came to pass. But in the course of this, we felt as a community that 10 years tactical plan must come to play. And in coming to play, we 
collaborate with our Awori Welfare Association of Nigeria to actually get what we called Awori Day. And by God's grace, everything went well the way it went. My name is Wasiu Oseni Ejure Molofin, an artist by excellence. I'm into the Sakura music genre. So, the son of the late Sakura exponent, Alaji Chief Dr. Oseni Ejure Omolofin. Uh, we had a successful Awori Day, and people are looking forward to see again in That's the year 2023 a successful one. What are you doing to ensure we have a big one, and what's your contribution so far to this great cause? To the glory of God, I worked alongside um, Prince Adetunji Femi Fadino, the chairman of the Awori Day Central Working Committee, Chief Michael Olaoleko, who was the advisory committee chairman. I am the chairman of the subcommittee of the Awori Day, uh, the music and entertainment committee precisely. All right. I tried my best in bringing out the music of Awori we brought out the rich culture of, of Awori music. So basically you're bringing, projecting the culture of the um, Awori people. Yes, you know, musically, uh, as it, yes, yes, wise. yes, as it implies. When you look at uh, Awori land in general, Awori day belongs to him. He came up with the idea and uh, we all uh, keyed into it. I mean, the others, he came around, he discussed with us, and we believe uh, it's a way forward that we can showcase our cultural heritage. So, sir, what are we looking forward when it comes to uh, our Bori Day 2023 and the challenges so far? in achieving this great art? Uh, first of all, I want to thank God for direction. This was the first one, so we expected all the challenges to see. I mean, as a tour operator, I remember my first uh, package tour to South Africa I had 35 points of weakness. After doing a post-analysis on Awuri Day itself, well, there are a lot of leakages, which is expected. And we will look at these leakages, we will prune them, and of course, I can rest assured you by 2023, I worry they will be bigger than what we're saying right now. The main purpose of that event was to project the Awori image, to project our culture. Aworis are majorly in Nobu and Lagos. Of course, some in diaspora, at least between 75 and 80 percent of Lagos land belong to the Aworis. But because of the problems we have, the problems of disunity, and we thank God, people now know that. In fact, if you were there on that day, people really came out, identified with the awardees. When you look at water, when you go around the world, you will see so many traces of water. So there is no doubt about it that water has uh, a lot to offer our holy land. With this, I believe we are going to key into it in order to make it, you know, a bigger event. I will give glory to God Almighty for what He did through all of us because we are all vessel unto honor. The truth is we had a good day and a good product. I can rest assure you with what we are seeing in view and I must give kudos to the Lagos State Governor, my brother, our son, who stood by us and also physically he was present at the event. Babaji de Olu. I give him kudos for his support both morally and financially. I must commend the Lagos State Government for giving us the brand to collaborate with because we also collaborate with their brand. For government to come is a brand we are collaborating with. He also give us a leverage to be able to play a bigger play. And the bigger play right now is what we're about to do, to unveil, uh, which is talking to the corporate audience. Thank God to my sister, who also stood with us, Her Excellency Engineer Noimot Salako Yedele, but she stood with us from the beginning. And also I must give kudos to my sister. I call her my dear sister, dependable patriot, Her Excellency Princess Ore Lokwe Adifulure. She stood 
with us from the beginning to the very end, even after the event. And also I must give thanks to my brother as well, my mentor, Chief Ashuaju Michael Olawale Ko, who also stood with us. Uh, there are several others who I cannot but mention. I can say just a big thank you to every single one, even those in the Central Working Committee. My appeal to all Awori sons and daughters. There is no community that you will not have some kind of rancors. The Aworis, we should continue to come out together. Whatever differences we have, when it comes to our thing, what I mean by our thing is that our, our Awori thing, we should always forget about our differences and come together and support the cause. Our KBCs, some of them, I am superior to you, you are inferior to me as well. When it comes to our things, everybody should forget about that. So if you are a KBC, you may think you are older than this or you are more powerful than this, but when it comes to our worries, please take the other KBC that you are having some rival, take him as your brother. Why the particular saying, I have a vision 2030? Well, to get things done, you know that tourism is an integral part of our economy. And it depends on how you actually structure the process itself. For the low budget and the high, high budgets, you can actually use tourism to effectively improve the IGR and job market. So we felt that if Gambia can do it, if we looked at Dubai, between 1964 to 1978 was desert. In the course of being desert, they manifested what we have today, a preferred destination. I felt that Amuri was a, is a unique product and it has to be carefully unveiled. After we looked at the destination evaluation, we looked at the total package of what Amuri is. I felt that we need to holistically harness our strength and we need to start looking forward to this. So we did a 10 years tactical plan. And in 2019, when we are unveiling, I said this, in two years, they will feel the heat. And exactly two years, we have dropped the product of our day. Our gods are happy with what is happening. I want to enjoy all uh, other sons and daughters, both at home and in diaspora, to please key into our day festival. <laughs> So we should expect to one in year sure. I can rest assured you, take it to the bank. 2023 to 2025 will be a land for our worried people. Thank you. So it's a promise uh, coming from the initiator mm. himself that uh, Come 2023, you get a bigger package from the Awari Festival. It's been a wonderful time uh, you. hosting you on Thank this you. very one. Thank you. We hope that um, God helps you, mm. you know, achieve more Thank and make landmark in Thank the Awari community. You. Thank you. To have a lovely day. Thank you. Thank Goodbye. you. <laughs> Bobo mo awori ni ti le toko eh odun awori malo deyo gbo wa katuyaya katuyaya katuyaya